evening from Pearl, Mississippi. We're at Trustmark Park, and it is the Governor's Cup ball game here this evening. A neutral site matchup between arch rivals on the baseball diamond. This will be the 39th time this ball game has been played, and it's been a very tightly contested series over the years. In fact, they played this Ole Miss ball club at home uh, three weekends ago, and Mississippi State took through two out of three from Ole Miss. Uh, the last one in dramatic fashion on the two-run walk-off home run by Luke Alexander. That's a pitch and that's line. That's towards the gap. Left center field, and that's got a chance to score a run. That will score a run. Throw comes in, and uh, no throw to the plate. They'll just hold it there, and it's a run scoring double by Rowe. Ole Miss takes the one nothing lead in the ball game. Query with a two ball, one strike count. The ball right back to the mound. He's going to go to third, and they've got the runner hung up. Row in a rundown. They'll toss, and now chase him back the other way. Alexander will tag him out. Runner down to second, and they tag him, and he's out, and the inning is over. Great catch and tag by Stovall and Ole Miss on the ball hit back to the mound. One to five to six to four. And there's a ball driven down the line. If it stays fair, it's trouble. It is trouble. It is off the wall in the corner. And that'll be a stand-up double that'll send uh, Gilbert around the third base. So there's a smash fair inside the bag at third. That should score and will score two, and Mangum will get a double out of it, and the Bulldogs have a two-to-one lead in the ball game. 2-2 pitch. And it's hit high and deep to right field, and that one is going to get out of the yard. A two-run homer, and Ole Miss regains the lead. And there's a fly ball. Chasing it is Mangum on the dive. He'll make the play. Runner will tag, and he will score on the play as Mangum takes a base hit away from Adam, and Ole Miss is on top again. It's 4-3. to three. Another 3-2 pitch, and it's strike three at the knees, and Zapowski is called out on strikes. First pitch, hit in the air, deep in the outfield, into the corner, into the crowd. Home run for Marshall Gilbert, and we're tied at four. Gilbert trots around the bases in a tie ball game. Well, he just ripped that one about 20 feet fair down the left field line and out of the ballpark, his second Bulldog home run this year. There's a ball in the air, right center field on the run, stretching out, diving catch made by the Bulldog, Jake Mango. Big time catch by Mango. I didn't think he could get to it, but he did. He makes an acrobatic play in right center field and takes a base hit away from Forte. Breaking ball, hit in the air, deep in the outfield. Back goes Spears, and he won't catch this one. It's off the wall. He goes to third, and that's another triple. This is a triples guy, but for the Bulldogs' Tanner Allen, that is his fifth triple of the year. And he hits it in the air to left field, and that'll do it. Back to catch it is Dillard. Tagging and scoring is Allen. Mississippi State takes a 5-4 lead in the ball game. We're tied 5-5 in the pitch. High drive deep in the outfield, chasing his Mangum. That ball is off the wall. Ole Miss has a lead, another stand-up double. And it is now a 6-5 Ole Miss lead in the ball game. Ole Miss here in the top of the ninth inning getting the job done to the plate. High fly ball, that should be caught. Right fielder over, McNamee is there. He makes the catch, and the inning is over, but Ole Miss gets two. 1-0 pitch to the plate, and it is lined over the head of the second baseman and the right field for a base hit. So a leadoff base hit. First pitch, grounded uh, back to the pitcher, and they're going to throw to first. Sacrifice successful by Rowdy Jordan. So Mangum is going to be intentionally passed. That sets up the double play opportunity. And there's ball four. It's not too often that you walk the potential winning run of the ball game, but that's what they did. So Mangum represents the potential winning run, the tying run down at second base. Alexander's just got to think they set the opposite way because Garacy's got that good slider to go with his fastball, and he can throw hard. And the pitch coming. 
Ball is in the air, in the gap, right center field, all the way to the wall. Mangum to third, across the plate is Anderson. Here he comes, here he comes, he scores. Bulldogs have won it in walk-off fashion by a score of seven to six over Ole Miss. What a way to end the ball game. What a job by Luke Alexander. He has walked Ole Miss off twice this season. That did it here at Trustmark Park.